What mechanism, though, does Satan use to get people to resist the Holy Spirit? Lies, Lies primarily. Uh, not the obvious ones that there's no God and we all evolve from slime. That's the obvious lie. It's the more subtle lies, like God is severe and gets angry if we ask questions. If you have faith, you don't ask questions. Faith just believes. Okay? God's law is imposed and he keeps track of sins that he must punish you by. God is a source of inflicted punishment we need to be protected from. Um, we have somebody standing between us as our advocate to plead his blood on our behalf. Sin is bad deeds uh, that need legal pardon. Jesus died to pay the penalty so we don't have to. These theologies are much more corrupting and corrosive in many ways than the idea that there's no God. And in fact, these theologies led to the entire rebellion against Christianity and the rejection of the idea of God at all because it's inconsistent with how reality works. Reality works on design law. This stuff is all arbitrary. 